Another tip, just in case you get sick of going to restaurant after restaurant every day, my advice would be to find non-food places that might surprise you. Um, so places that you wouldn't necessarily think of going to eat. You wouldn't go there for a meal, um, but when you get there you realize that food is part of the experience there. Um, for example, I was in, um, when I was in Richmond um, about a year or so ago, I was at a Sikh temple and as soon as I walked in I could smell that there was definitely food happening there. <laughs> um, and I was asking around, I was sort of led into the back part and there was a kitchen there. And it's actually open 24 hours and it was uh, all vegetarian food and it was free. So that was a, a complete surprise. I didn't go there to eat. I was there to explore the temple and I found a whole culinary experience there. All of the people were very friendly and wanted to share um, tips about how to eat the food, how it was prepared, and there's a, there was a whole story there that um, I never would have known existed except that I stepped inside looking for something else and found that food indeed was a part of that. Um, it's also a way to, um, again, get beyond just a meal and get into, um, in this case, the religion <coughs> behind the meal, um, the culture behind the meal, things that make the food really important to, um, to a person's beliefs. And I think that is interesting. It's interesting to know why things are done, um, and it's interesting to know um, the processes behind it. And I, I just I bring that example up because it I was so surprised. I, I just had no idea that um, that such a non-food environment would in fact be a real jewel of a place to go and um, and have a meal. So I would say that there there are probably a lot more things like that where you can. Um, you know, maybe in a, a little corner of a mall or something where, you know, there's um, a stall set up or uh, I don't know, I'm just thinking off the top of my head here, but um, places where you're not expecting to, um, to find food. Sometimes those are the best places to find food. <laughs>